In this video, we'll learn how to use the Rossman Chance Applet to find the mean and standard deviation of a given data set. So to do this, you first need to access the Rossman Chance Applet's website, and you'll select the Descriptive Statistics Applet. You'll then just copy and paste your data in there and checkbox the items that you wish to view, like your mean and standard deviation. So let's go ahead and go through an example. Below I have three data sets. Um, so for company A, these are five salaries of employees at company A. I'm just going to copy those. I'm now going to link to the Rossman Chance applets. Here we are. And you see in the top left-hand corner the descriptive statistics applet. That's the one we want to go to, so I select that. I'm going to clear out the data that's in there by default. So I've copied and pasted the data into the cell, and now I'm gonna click Use Data. There it is. And you see the dot plot here is very boring. We have five dots above uh, 150,000. Now I'm interested in having it tell me the mean, so I click Actual Mean next to, right here, and I click Actual Standard Deviation, and you see that right here, it gives you the value of the mean, 150,000, and the standard deviation is zero. And we know the standard deviation is zero because there is no deviation between the data values and the mean. There is zero deviation, zero difference between the data values and the mean. Let's do the same thing for company B. So for company B, I clear out the data from the last data set. I click Use Data and it gives me a dot plot where we have one dot above each of those five data values. The mean is that value right in the middle, which is 150,000. The standard deviation is 15,811.39 cents. So that's saying on average, these data values are $15,811 away from the mean. And lastly, for company C, we copy and paste the data or type the data in click Use Data, we see there are two salaries that are 500, there are two salaries that are above 299,500, and there's one salary right in the middle at 150,000. It says the mean is $150,000 salary, standard deviation is 149,500. So on average, the salaries are $149,500 away from the average salary.